hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to show you how i did this finger licking good garden x2 stay with me as we go through this video together So in my saucepan, I'll add the salted fermented fish, also known as momone. I used this particular oil to fry chicken earlier, so that is what I'll be using for my stew. So I've already cooked my garden eggs or eggplant, pepper and turkey berries. Garden eggs sometimes have worms in it, so before you cook, you have to cut it into two. Check it very well to see if there are no worms in it. If there's any, you can just pick it out before you cook. Now I'll go ahead and add my onions to the oil. and allow it to cook very well. So I'll go ahead and grind my garden eggs, pepper and turkey berries in an earthenware bowl, also known as a potoyua or a sanka, with my wood masha, also known as eta or tapoli in our local language. We don't want it to become very smooth, so we will leave it at this consistency. At this point, I'll add fresh tomatoes to my onions. So let it cook for some time. And I'll add a cube spice to it. I'll add sardines to it. You can use mackerel or anything that you prefer. I'll go ahead and beat up three large eggs very well. and add it to the stew. So let it fry for some time before we stir it up. This is the right way to stir your stew. You really don't want to do this type of stirring. Otherwise your eggs, your fish and everything will just tear up apart in your stew. At this point, we will add the garden eggs. We'll give it a good stir and make sure it mixes up very well. And now I'll go ahead and add my green bell peppers to it. Not only are they rich in iron, 
but they are also rich in vitamin C and they will also give flavor to our stew. And now we'll add salt to taste. Our stew is almost ready. Our stew is ready and we'll be serving while it's hot. There we go.